Good day, brothers and sisters in Christ. The lowly servant here. Welcome to my channel. Today is August 22nd, Saturday of the 20th week in ordinary time. And we celebrate the memorial of the queenship of the Blessed Virgin Mary. The Gospel said, For they preach but they do not practice. Let's have a listen and reflect on it after. But first, The first reading is from the book of Ezekiel. The angel led me to the gate which faces the east. And there I saw the glory of the God of Israel. Coming from the east. I heard a sound like the roaring of many waters. And the earth shone with his glory. The vision was like that which I had seen. When he came to destroy the city. And like that which I had seen by the river Kabar. I fell prone as the glory of the Lord entered the temple, by way of the gate which faces the east. But Spirit lifted me up and brought me to the inner court, and I saw that the temple was filled with the glory of the Lord. Then I heard someone speaking to me from the temple, while the man stood beside me. The voice said to me, Son of man, this is where my throne shall be. This is where I will set the soles of my feet. Here I will dwell among the children of Israel forever. Responsorial Psalm The glory of the Lord will dwell in our land. I will hear what God proclaims. The Lord for he proclaims peace. Near indeed is his salvation to those who fear him. Glory dwelling in our land. The glory of the Lord will dwell in our land. Kindness and truth shall meet. Justice and peace shall kiss. Truth shall spring out of the earth. And justice shall look down from heaven. The glory of the Lord will dwell in our land. The Lord himself will give his benefits. Our land shall yield its increase. Justice shall walk before him and salvation, along the way of his steps. The glory of the Lord will dwell in our land. Alleluia, Alleluia. You have but one Father in heaven. You have but one Master, the Christ. Alleluia, Alleluia. The Gospel according to Matthew. Jesus spoke to the crowds and to his disciples, saying, The scribes and the Pharisees have taken their seat on the chair of Moses. Therefore, do and observe all things whatsoever they tell you. But do not follow their example. For they preach but they do not practice. They tie up heavy burdens hard to carry, and lay them on people's shoulders but they will not lift a finger to move them. All their works are performed to be seen. They widen their phylacteries and lengthen their tassels. They love places of honor at banquets, seats of honor in synagogues, greetings in marketplaces, and the salutation rabbi. As for you, do not be called rabbi. You have but one teacher, and you are all brothers. Call no one on earth your father, you have but one Father in heaven. Do not be called Master, you have but one Master, the Christ. The greatest among you must be your servant. Whoever exalts himself will be humbled, but whoever humbles himself will be exalted. Reflection One week after we have celebrated the Assumption of our Blessed Said Mother, we are now transported to the heavenly realm to witness her being raised as the Queen of Heaven and Earth. She is the mother of the Son of God, the King of the universe. She is the obedient daughter of the Father who surrendered herself absolutely to his will. She is the partner of the Holy Spirit who overshadowed her and taken forth the Son of God into the world. She is the sinless virgin, complete of grace and love. She is the Cordemptrix and the mother of the Church. Her royal crowning suggests that we, as her children, 
can share in the glory given to her, if we follow in her footsteps. Let us endeavor to be like Mary, in our mind, body and spirit. That's the end of my reflection. If you'd like a daily dose of the word of the Lord, subscribe to my channel and click on the notification bell, so you won't miss out on such, and other related uploads, like novenas and prayers. Be safe and always keep God in your hearts. Peace to all.